Um, my name is Jim Drinkwine, and today I'm going to be talking about uh, uh, gallery walks. Um, we did a gallery walk today on the uh, rules of grammar that came from our uh, textbook. And in here, the author presents rules as either real rules, um, social rules, uh, invented rules, or hobgoblins is what he calls them, fake rules. I um, wrote out all the rules in Word, cut them out, pasted them onto index cards, three per card. I handed those out to students and they had to write whether the rule was a real rule or one of the other options. They had to talk a little bit about the history of what that, uh, where that rule is and then write a sentence that follows the rule and a sentence that breaks the rule. Today we put all of those up onto our um, gallery images and uh, walked around and talked about them. Uh, the reason for this is clarity. We're talking about rules and grammar because a as a business writing class they need to understand what is effective communication, what is not effective communication on the page, and also how to speak so they sound like they know what they're talking about. A lot of students come in with poor grammar and uh, it shows in their speech patterns. And getting them to recognize how, how their speaking reflects is one of the reasons that we're doing this. That somehow, I wrote it there. They have a, like a special name for it. When, when it's correctly, but it sounds weird, uh, sounds pedantic. This is, so I have the same thing here. That's how they call it. The gallery walk itself took close to an hour to do. Uh, other gallery walks that I have done have taken much less time, um, where I just have an image on the paper and ask the students to walk around and just write their first thoughts when they see the image. Then as a group we walk around and we look at the different thoughts that come up. So I find the gallery walk is a good way to get people up and moving, to get people engaged in concepts and ideas that may seem a little odd or hard to lecture on, and um, get them engaged with each other in the learning as well.